Hi guys, thought I'd show you um, the radio I got from the Red Rose Winter Rally. I uploaded a video about the rally the, uh, the other week, and this is uh, one of the bargains I picked up there. Um, it's a Kenwood Trio TM uh, 411E. It's a 70 centimetres, uh, 430 to 440 uh, here in the UK. Um, FM transceiver, mobile transceiver, um, which I thought was really nice. Got it for uh, 30 quid. Um, absolute bargain, full working order and fairly decent nick as well. Um, so I'll show you a video of me talking on it to a friend in a few minutes, but I just thought I'd show you it. It's really nice. I like the uh, the colour on it. Um, nice little display, and it's got the uh, it's got like the little uh, signal meter there. Um, I'm not got an antenna plugged into this at the moment. I've just plugged it, put it on the power supply to show you. Um, so it's got your uh, frequency select uh, button there, knob there. It's got um, all sorts of uh, controls here. Which if I'd done me uh, if I'd done my research better and had the manual in front, I'd be able to tell you more about what they do. But I'm sure if you've uh, if you're familiar with this type of radio, you'll know what it you'll know what it does. You've got your your offset switch there. Um, so you can do simplex um, or plus or negative offset. Your squelch button there. Uh, and power and volume. But it's a, it's a really nice radio. Come with the mounting bracket. It's got this like swivel head on it as well, which is good. So you can uh, you can have it in your car and you can. You can swivel the head up or down, um, so you can get it in the uh, the best position for you. It does need an external speaker, which I've got, but again, I'm not plugged in because I've only shown it yet. Um, came with a power cable and stuff, and this, this nice little microphone as well, the Kenwood MC42S microphone. So, so yeah, really nice, uh, really nice tidy radio, well worth the price. Looks nice on the shelf in the shack. Um, I say it's FM only; it's not not a multi mode. I have used it. Um, I've tested it out and it works, it works exactly as it should, so uh, yeah, all good stuff. So I'll cut now to a video of, you, uh, of it in use and you can, uh, you can have a look at uh, how it works and what it, what it sounds like. Yeah, 550. 550. M3HHY, is this frequency in use please? No, nothing heard. Yeah, M3HHY, G1KXP. Um, yeah, sounds good. Um, is, it, is it the first time you've tried it, or have you had any other QSOs on it today? M3HHY returning. I tried it before, quickly, with um, a friend of mine in Stockport, but uh, it's obviously a lot further away. I'm only just running 5 watts, um, so uh, yeah, I'm really happy with it. It was, it was 30 quid. Um, the guy was selling it for 60 earlier, and he, was, he wanted to go. Um, he was packing up, so I uh, made him an offer, and he... Uh, yeah, accepted. It works. It works a charm. I'll have to send you some more photos uh, from M3HHY. Yeah, G1KXP returning. It sounds very well, actually. I must. I must say, uh, I couldn't quite tell from the the photograph. The, um, the 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 lettering across the top was slightly. I don't know if it was a flash photograph or whether it was just light in the in the room. But I couldn't uh, couldn't see the model of it, which is why I didn't recognise it. No, it sounds really well. Um, certainly sounds like uh, a lot more than five watts. But um, no, sounds great. Yeah, it's it's a shame. I like going to that rally. We uh, we usually go every year. And uh, you, you get to see the same sort of same faces, and I've had some good stuff myself from there over the years. But it, it just worked out that we'd arranged to.